Alrighty guys, it's been a while. This is my uh, update on my B-Nice and my T-Bars. So I did switch or um, separate them now. This tank is all B-Nice now. Um, right front and center here is our biggest B-Nice. He's not turning around or He's not giving us a side profile yet, but even though this he or she is the biggest, um, I don't know, he's not that detailed or he doesn't have a lot of colorations or pattern to him, although he does put on a good amount of size and he's got a big old belly. Actually, most of them <laughs> in here has a big belly. Um, I'm feeding them twice a day. Um, I don't know if that's good or bad, but I think that seems to be um, that's what my schedule allows for. And again, these guys are putting on weight, so that's a good thing. Um, I did lose my my um, B eye that has a one has that has that missing eye. Um, so unfortunately, I did lose him. He got very skinny, and um, I tried feeding him brine shrimp. Um, I separated him out with another one that is um, on the thin side and I fed them almost exclusively frozen baby brine but um, he didn't make it. Um, the other guy he's still in that um, separated tank so he isn't in here. Um, right now I'm down to 8 and if you remember I started with 11 so I've lost 3 so far and hopefully the other one can pull through. Um, he's with the, he's in the 75 with the Islatums, but he's in the breeder breeder net. So um, when I do the update there, um, we'll get a chance to look at him. I'm probably gonna put him back within a week in here, just because he needs more space um, to grow, and I don't want these guys to um, outgrow him. Again, the plan is to get a, another bigger tank, um, anywhere around um, a 60 breeder to possibly 105 gallon. Um, and if I can get the bigger end, then that tank would be for the be nice. But if I couldn't and I have to resort to the 60 breeder, then we'll have to go with. Um, the be nice in the 75 and then move out um, the Islatums into the 60s. Um, and that's because the be nice are, um, has the potential to be a bigger fish than the Islatums. Um, don't quote me, but I believe these, um, the males can grow up to 16 inches, whereas the Islatums kind of max out at around 12. So. Um, yeah, but I don't know. They're still very skittish. Um, maybe because I have this tank blocked off um, for the most part uh, during the day. But um, they're, they're doing good and I can't um, complain. Okay, 